Greece, a country with a rich history and breathtaking landscapes. Nestled in the southeastern part of Europe, Greece is a nation that has captivated the hearts of many with its incredible fusion of ancient history, vibrant culture, and stunning geographical features. This country's allure lies not only in its sun-drenched islands and azure seas, but also in its labyrinthine alleys and time-worn ruins that whisper tales of gods, heroes, and philosophers. From the birthplace of democracy, Athens, to the awe-inspiring sunsets of Santorini, each corner of Greece offers an enchanting experience. We'll journey through the monasteries in the sky at Meteora, feel the winds of the charming island of Mykonos, and delve into the mysteries of Delphi, once considered the navel of the world. This video is your passport to some of Greece's most captivating destinations, each one a testament to the country's enduring charm and timeless allure. So buckle up and join us as we embark on an unforgettable journey through Greece's most captivating destinations. Our first stop is Athens, the cradle of Western civilization. Nestled in the heart of Greece, Athens is a city steeped in history and culture. Inhabited for over 3,000 years, this ancient city is often referred to as the birthplace of democracy, a political system that has shaped the modern world as we know it today. The city's history is a testament to the grandeur of ancient Greece. The Athenians, led by the famed statesman Pericles, built some of the most iconic structures of the ancient world. Among them is the Acropolis, a fortified hilltop standing tall amidst the city's skyline. Atop this hill you'll find the Parthenon, an enduring symbol of Athens and a masterpiece of Doric architecture. But Athens is not just about the past. The city pulses with a vibrant street life that is as captivating as its historical landmarks. Walk down its bustling streets and you'll find an eclectic mix of traditional tavernas serving delicious Greek cuisine, modern cafes brewing the finest coffee, and lively markets brimming with local produce and handicrafts. And let's not forget the city's thriving art scene. From world-class museums housing priceless antiquities to contemporary art galleries showcasing the works of emerging artists, Athens is a haven for art lovers. The city also hosts a number of cultural festivals throughout the year, offering a glimpse into its rich traditions and customs. Athens is also a city of contrasts. Amidst its ancient ruins, you'll find a bustling metropolis that never sleeps. The city is home to a thriving nightlife, with a plethora of bars, clubs, and music venues that cater to every taste. Whether you're into jazz, rock, or traditional Greek music, there's something for everyone in Athens. So, whether you're a history buff, a foodie, an art enthusiast, or a night owl, Athens has something to offer. Its rich history, vibrant culture, and modern attractions make it a must-visit destination. From ancient ruins to bustling city life, Athens offers a unique blend of the old and the new. Next, we head to the island of Santorini, known for its stunning sunsets and whitewashed buildings. A jewel of the Aegean Sea, Santorini is an island that captivates the heart with its mesmerizing beauty. Imagine an expanse of whitewashed houses clinging to the cliffside, their blue domes standing out against the azure sky. This is the iconic image of Santorini that has enchanted travelers from around the globe. Santorini is not just about picture-perfect vistas, it's also home to some of the most unique beaches you'll ever come across. These aren't your usual sandy stretches. Here the beaches are formed from volcanic rocks, lending them an array of colors from red to black. The most famous of these is the Red Beach, which gets its name from the striking red hue of the cliffs that surround it. But Santorini's allure doesn't stop there. The island is steeped in history, a history that is as turbulent as it is fascinating. One of the most significant events in Santorini's past is the Minoan eruption. This catastrophic volcanic event, which took place around three and a half thousand years ago, forever changed the face of the island. It was this eruption that created Santorini's unique crescent-shaped geography. Today, the island's volcano lies dormant, but its impact can still be felt, from the unique landscape to the rich, fertile soil that produces some of the island's famous wines. As the day draws to a close, there's one more spectacle that Santorini has to offer, its legendary sunset. As the sun dips below the horizon, the sky is painted with hues of orange, pink, and purple, casting a magical glow over the island. It's a sight that's as breathtaking as it is romantic, and it's the perfect way to end a day in this Greek paradise. With its breathtaking views and rich history, Santorini is indeed a piece of paradise on Earth. Now, let us take you to Meteora, home to monasteries perched high in the sky. In the heart of Greece, amidst the encompassing embrace of the Pindus Mountains, 
the unique landscape of Meteora unfolds. Here, towering sandstone rock pillars reach for the heavens, their peaks adorned with ancient monasteries. The name Meteora, meaning suspended in the air, couldn't be more fitting. These monasteries, silhouetted against the backdrop of the azure sky, seem to defy gravity. They are a testament to the human spirit's unyielding resolve and ingenuity. Built in the 14th century, they served as spiritual retreats, places of peace, and bastions of orthodoxy during the turbulence of the Byzantine era. The monks who first sought refuge here climbed these formidable rock formations with little more than their faith as a safety rope. They led a life of solitude, prayer, and contemplation, far from the trappings of the mundane world. Their only connection to the ground below were precarious ladders and nets used to haul up supplies and the occasional daring pilgrim. Today, six of these sky-high sanctuaries remain active, each a marvel of medieval architecture. They house priceless artifacts and religious iconography preserved over centuries. Each monastery has its own unique charm, whether it's the panoramic views from the Holy Trinity, the ancient frescoes of Varlam, or the tranquil gardens of St. Stephen S. The monastic life continues here, albeit with modern conveniences. The monks and nuns still observe the traditional rites, their chants echoing amidst the silent majesty of the rocks. If you listen closely, you might catch the faint tolling of a bell, the call to prayer carried by the wind. Meteora is not just a historical site or a geological wonder, it's a place of profound spirituality, a testament to faith's enduring strength and the human capacity for awe and reverence. It's a place that invites introspection, a reminder of our place in the grand tapestry of existence. Next, we visit Mykonos, the island of the winds. A pearl in the Aegean Sea, this island mesmerizes with its stark white architecture contrasting with the Cerulean Sea. This island, famously known as the Island of the Winds, is a captivating blend of history, beauty, and excitement. Let's start with the island's most iconic landmarks, the windmills. These striking structures, dating back to the 16th century, are a testament to the island's prosperous past. Once used to mill wheat, they now stand as silent observers, watching over the island's vibrant life. They are not just a symbol of Mykonos' rich history, but they also provide a perfect backdrop for a memorable sunset. Speaking of sunsets, they are not the only spectacle when the sun goes down. As dusk falls, the island transforms into a playground for those who love the nightlife. From sophisticated cocktail bars to lively nightclubs, there is something for everyone on this island that never sleeps. The island is home to some of the most beautiful beaches in Greece. Whether you prefer the bustling beach clubs of Paradise and Super Paradise or the tranquil sands of Agios Sostis, each beach here has its unique charm. But what is an island without its myths? According to Greek mythology, this was where Hercules fought and killed the invincible giants. The large rocks scattered around the island are believed to be the petrified corpses of these giants, an island that beautifully marries the old with the new, the tranquil with the exciting. It's a place where you can explore ancient myths in the morning, relax on a stunning beach in the afternoon, and dance the night away under the starlit sky. Our journey continues to Delphi, once considered the center of the world. Imagine a place steeped in ancient history, shrouded in myth and legend. Nestled in the heart of Greece on the slopes of Mount Parnassus, Delphi was revered in the ancient world. It was known as the Omphalos, or the navel of the world. This wasn't just a metaphorical title. The Greeks believed that Zeus sent two eagles flying from opposite ends of the universe, and their paths crossed in the sky above Delphi, marking it as the center of the world. Breathe in the air of Delphi, and you're breathing in the whispers of Greek mythology. Apollo, the god of light, music, and prophecy, was said to have slain the serpent Python here to establish his oracle. This oracle was the most prestigious in all of ancient Greece, a place where mortals sought divine guidance. Kings, warriors, and ordinary folk would journey from far and wide to consult the Pythia, the high priestess of the Temple of Apollo. Seated on a tripod above a chasm in the earth, she would inhale the vapors rising from below and fall into a trance, her cryptic utterances then interpreted by the priests. Today, Delphi is a UNESCO World Heritage Site, a treasure trove of ruins and relics. As you wander the archaeological site, you'll find yourself stepping back in time, walking in the footsteps of the ancients. There's the Temple of Apollo, where the oracle gave her predictions, the ancient theater and the stadium, where athletes once competed in the Pythian Games. Don't forget to visit the Delphi Archaeological Museum. 
Here you can marvel at the rich collection of artifacts unearthed from the site, including the famous bronze charioteer of Delphi, an exquisite example of ancient Greek sculpture. Delphi is more than a place. It's a journey into the past, a window into the soul of ancient Greece. It's a testament to the enduring power of myth and legend, to the human desire for knowledge and understanding. Next, we sail to Corfu, the emerald island of the Ionian Sea. This stunning island is aptly named for its lush green landscapes that seem to sparkle like a gem in the azure blue waters of the sea. The island is not only a paradise for nature lovers, but it also offers an exciting journey through history and culture for those seeking a deeper connection with the past. Corfu's Old Town, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, is a living testament to the island's rich history. Here, the narrow cobbled streets flanked by elegant Venetian-style buildings transport you back in time. It's easy to get lost in the charm of the old town with its beautiful squares, quaint cafes, and bustling markets. But Corfu's history extends far beyond its charming old town. The island's strategic location made it a coveted prize for many civilizations, including the Romans, Byzantines, Venetians, French, and British, all of whom left their mark on the island. This rich tapestry of cultural influences is evident in everything from Corfu's architecture to its cuisine. But the island's history goes back even further, into the realms of Greek mythology. It was on Corfu that Poseidon, the god of the sea, fell in love with the nymph Corcyra and brought her to the island, which he named in her honor. And it was here that the legendary hero Odysseus was washed ashore and met the beautiful nymph Nausicaa, a story immortalized in Homer's epic, The Odyssey. Whether you're basking in the sun on one of Corfu's beautiful beaches, exploring its historic sites, or immersing yourself in its vibrant culture, you'll find that Corfu is more than just an island. Our exploration of Greece's most iconic locales now draws to its conclusion. These are but a few of the countless wonders Greece has in store. These must-see places you all should witness for yourselves. Until our next adventure, maintain that curiosity and never stop discovering. If you love adventure as much as we do, then don't forget to hit the like button, share with your friends, and subscribe for more thrilling voyages across the globe. Thank you for watching.